Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome, my name is Christine. Today we're gonna do a little sustainable clothing haul. A while back I talked about how much I wanted to start moving into sustainable fashion. Now, does that mean that I'm gonna be completely switching over? No, but I think that any steps towards the right direction is still progress. So anyways, I picked up some things here from Girlfriend and Everlane that I wanted to share with you all. There's gonna be a little try on portion as well. And I'll go ahead and link my sizing, body measurements, and all of that good stuff like I always do down below. So before we go ahead and get started, first make sure you hit the subscribe button if you haven't already and the little notification bell, join the little notification squad. Without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. First off, I picked up some active wear from Girlfriend. If you guys haven't heard of the brand, there actually has been a lot of buzz around social media around this brand and they're first known for their leggings. So I'm actually wearing a pair of them today. I was super interested because this is their best-selling bra and I believe this is called the Paloma bra and I was really drawn to the color. I think a couple weeks ago they're having a 20% off site wide so I was like let me just place an order and I love that they're also sustainable. I think they're really well known because a lot of the fabrics and materials that they use are from recycled water bottles. This is one of their best sellers and when I first got it I was so impressed by the quality. The color really speaks to me and I got a matching score that I'll show you in a second but it's really flattering and body hugging and I could see myself wearing this to workouts or even like athleisure. Anywhere where I don't feel like wearing a normal bra, it's super comfortable, made out of like really thick material. I also like that this one is a little bit of a longer cut and I believe on their website this was around 40 to 50 dollars and I think because it is a sustainable brand, I think it's totally worth the money. Then I got the matching color and this is actually a little squirt situation. This is so cute and I don't know when I'm gonna wear something like this. Maybe when I go to the golf course with Brandon or going to play tennis or I feel like even with any type of regular outfit, this would be such a cute thing to wear with it. I love that this is a skort, but you can't really tell. Actually, I don't know if this would classify as a skort because it looks like a skirt, but underneath you have like the little legging short lining on the inside so it's super comfortable and i feel really safe wearing this out because even though it is a little mini skirt i like that i have another layer of protection underneath so i can do activities and stuff like that it's super high-waisted and i got it in a size small i feel like i'm in that in-between phase where i don't know if i'm a small or a medium so i wanted this to fit me really snugly around the waist so i did get it in a small and it fits me really nicely Next thing that I got from Girlfriend are these leggings, and I forget what style I got, but I'll go ahead and pop it on the screen, but I actually tried out their leggings a couple of years ago, and I was not super impressed because it wasn't comfortable. Like, it contained so many different seams that I feel like it pinched my body, and it wasn't the most flattering either, so I wanted to try a new pair of their leggings that I hadn't tried before, and these ones are super soft and comfortable feeling. It kind of reminds me of, like, the Lululemon Aligns, but a little bit less silky feeling. They're still super comfortable and I actually got these in a size medium just because I wanted the leggings to fit me well but I wanted to be comfortable in them. It is a little bit loose around the waist which I don't mind because it does make them like a really good lounge pair and I feel like the price of these are so reasonable and I love that this company is sustainable like I said. A while back I talked about like fast fashion and why I wanted to stop supporting those brands. Brands like Princess Polly, Uniqlo's even fast fashion, H&M, Zara. There's so many dangers to fast fashion and I just don't wanna support that anymore. And there are just so many other brands I would way rather support with my money. So I encourage you to do the same. It doesn't mean that you have to fully go balls to the wall, everything sustainable, but I think any type of little steps towards that is better than not doing anything. So don't really wanna to go too much into that because I feel like I've talked about it a couple times already. Next thing that I picked up is some socks. And so I was actually the most interested in trying their socks because I love these high socks. They're perfect for chunky sneakers or anytime I just want like a cooler look to my outfit. And I always get asked where I get my favorite ones from and actually Uniqlo and Amazon have my favorite ones. So I wanted to explore a sustainable option and these socks are so comfortable and so thick. They for sure are gonna be my new favorite everyday sock. And so I got just the plain 
white ones are super thick and lush and then I also got a pair of these kind of like light gray greenish color but again they're so comfortable and so plush and I love the way that they look they also gave me a cute little zipper pouch with my order which I don't even is this a wash bag a laundry bag I'm not sure but it's cute it says girlfriend on it so I'll probably use it for laundry or when I travel and pack lingerie, I don't know. The last thing that I picked from Girlfriend is some underwear. And I'm actually today going to be filming a little outfit video. You know, like one of those trendy lookbooks where the girl is just in her lingerie and she's changing into multiple outfits. I'm going to be filming one of those later today. So I thought it would be cute to have some cute underwear for those types of videos. And I just wanted to try out and see how these are and how they fit and all that. And I was super impressed by the quality. They feel so stinking comfortable and they have so many cute colors as well i believe they have matching bralettes but i don't need any more bralettes so i just picked up this thong panty it's supposed to be seamless as well i also got these these are a little bit more high-waisted and these are just like my comfortable chilling at home panty don't really care about underlines or anything like that but i think that the color is super cute i got these in a size small because i wanted them to fit me snugly so i will keep you updated or pop on the screen if they are truly seamless and if underwear lines show with them or not because if i could wear these without underwear line showing that would be great so I think my whole girlfriend order was around $200, which with the discount is really not bad at all because I feel like I did get a lot of things and the material all feels really nice and luxe. I'm definitely curious to see how the other sports bras and leggings fit, but definitely will be ordering more of the socks and underwear because those are so stinking cute. Next, I have some more things from Everlane. So I actually recently placed a really fat order that's not going to come for another few weeks, but... I've been wanting to do like an updated Aritzia Essentials video and I thought it'd be fun to do like an Everlane Essentials video. I love that they're all about sustainability. They have a lot of really good basics on their website. I wanted to pick up some like unique items that I don't really have in my closet. So if you guys want to see the Everlane Essentials video, stay tuned because that video is coming in the next few weeks. But first thing that I picked up from this recent Everlane haul is this cashmere tee. It's really interesting and I love the color, but like a cashmere tee, I don't know if I would wear it when it's cold or, or when it's hot. It's super comfortable and I like that the cashmere is not itchy. It's very important to me because anything that is like not comfortable on, I'm just not going to wear it. Also, all of these items were kindly gifted from Everlane. This video is not sponsored, but I work with them a lot, so I do get some gifting from them. This top you've seen in so many videos, and this will probably be in my Everlane Essentials video, but I recently got this and I'm obsessed with it. It's such a unique top and I just love the way that it kind of adds a little something something to your outfit but it's just like a really good neutral sweater that goes with so many different things and this also is cashmere it's super comfortable and perfect for layering next we have this sweater and i don't know why i got another brown neutral sweater because i have so many but this is just like a really good deep brown color really good for layering and i've been getting more into like the brownie tones because i feel like i wear so much black and white i wanted to add a little bit more color but like neutral colors so i feel like this is a really good piece to wear i feel like with some brown pants and a brown coat it would just be like the vibes this is also another cashmere piece and i guess i just was really into the cashmere like i said i have a lot of sweaters and similar items in my closet already but i don't have a lot of cashmere so i definitely wanted to add some more luxe fabrics to my collection a couple more things left i got this blazer from everlane and i've only worn it in a lookbook i actually haven't even worn it out yet because it hasn't been cold enough in la i also specifically turned off the heat for this video so that i wouldn't be sweating okay this blazer is so cute it's actually made of kind of like a thicker wool material so i feel like if you live anywhere colder this would be a really great piece to layer with even if it's like kind of that in-between season you could just wear this on its own but I love the pattern of it and I love me a good blazer and I feel like this one fits really well. I have it in a size 4. Then I picked up these booties and I feel like these are so stinking cute. I was in Big Bear a couple of weeks ago and I wore my Doc Martens almost every single day because those are such good like winter snow shoes so i kind of wanted to pick up a pair of shoes that would also be good in the snow even though i don't know when the next time i'll be in the snow is but it's just good to be prepared okay 
And I feel like this would also be like a really cute addition to any outfit. It kind of changes it up from your regular booty. And these are just like the classic Chelsea boot, but I like that these are a really cool white colors. I could see myself wearing this in any like cold winter weather with some cute high socks or some wool socks would be super, super cute. The shape of these were really nice. And when I first saw them on the Everlane website, I was just like, I need to have those. Last thing I got were some athleisure legging sets. And so if, if you guys follow me on Instagram, I actually now have a personal trainer. So I go to see him two times a week. His name is Robert. And if you guys are interested, his Instagram is like Westlake Sports, Performance Sports or something. I'll go ahead and pop it on screen. But I love him. He's a really great personal trainer. And it's a really great way to like force me to show up two times a week to work out. So I've been into getting more cute workout sets because I actually wear them now instead of just wearing them around the house and the quality is really really nice i almost want to say that the girlfriend ones are a little bit thicker and plusher and these ones more feel like a slippery material i don't even know how to describe it but super comfortable very form flattering i just feel like this whole set is so flattering on my body it sucks me in in all the right places and this color is also super cute I feel like with my skin tone, it's hard to find a good nude set that doesn't make you look naked. And so I like that this has a really good like orangey tone. Then I also picked up a black legging set. And again, I'm a really big fan of these leggings and I feel like no one talks about these Everlane leggings. Really good price point, super high waisted. And they remind me a lot of the Lululemon Aligns, but just not quite as like silky soft but especially for the price point i think that these are a really great deal and i love how high waisted they are with the matching sports bra this one and the girlfriend one don't contain any padding which i actually don't mind at all i feel like it does give me all of that protection and coverage really holds me in when i'm working out so i feel really secure in it and i just think it's a really flattering set and super good price point as well also if you're curious i actually picked up this shirt from a flea market a while back. Brandon and I have been going to flea markets almost every single Sunday. Kind of a fun way to get out of the house but still shop in a way that is sustainable. So anyways, that brings us to the end of this haul. I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll go ahead and link all the products that I talked about down below as well. If you guys want to see more of these haul videos, more sustainable fashion brands, let me know. But that is all. Don't forget to hit a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video and I will see you all next time. Bye.